So hello, hello all folks. It's good to see you all here again. I know you guys are excited for some fascinating role news and analysis, but before we move on to any further details, I would really love to thank you all for your enormous love and support. And in case you haven't subscribed to my channel, I mean, what are you guys waiting for? Hit that subscribe button now and please don't forget to press the bell icon. I mean, I don't want you guys to miss any of the latest royal drama, right? Perfect, so let's get started. So, when Prince William watches on his father, King Charles' crown, it will be an insight into what his future holds when he one day takes the throne. But the Prince of Wales won't just be a spectator for the historic celebration on May 6. He is expected to have a number of vital roles in the ceremony. Well, while Buckingham Palace is yet to officially confirm which royals will be doing what, Prince, uh, royal expert and historian Tessa Dunlop has shared her best educated guess about what they could look like. She tells the mirror, Prince William and his offsprings are next in line to the throne and coronation deliberately emphasizes the order of precedence and succession. Like it or not, this state occasion is all about royal hierarchy. Visual message through both costume and carriage will remind us who the future king and queen are, whether the Sussexes like it or not. Well, as part of his plan to strip the ceremony back, uh, it's understood that Charles has scrapped part of the coronation, which sees royals, dukes, killing and paying homage to him. Traditionally, uh, they would also touch the crown and kiss the monarch's right cheek. However, William, as a heir to the throne, will still do this, but he will be the only one. Tesha believed that the Wales family will stand out during the event. So, will have very different role to Prince Harry and Meghan Markle if they do decide to attend. The ads, in 1953, the Queen's sister, Princess Margaret, had her own coronation gown designed by Norman Hartnell, embroidered with roses and daisies, and offset with a stunning Cartier Ciara. She travelled to the Abbey with the Queen's mother and they sat in a box overlooking proceeding with a four-year-old Prince Charles squashed between them. Uh, a similar scenario for the Prince of Wales and her three children is likely to be seen. So, what do you think about this news, guys? Please share your thoughts in the comment and let me know what you think. Until then, thanks for watching. We'll see you again with some more fascinating royal news and analysis. Until then, hasta la vista.